Okay, hi guys, welcome to a new vlog. Um, I am literally just about to run out the door. Chase is gonna be downstairs in a minute because I need to go and record with Aaliyah. And then um, our restrictions got changed to where we live. I know we're still going through all of this in Canada. Don't make fun of us. It's not funny, it sucks. But um, the restrictions where we live got changed so I can actually legally work with Charlie inside a building again. I don't have to keep working with her outside anymore on green space six feet apart. I can go inside and work with her six feet apart. We also have um, the prop that I was interested in using for Charlie. She hasn't had a chance to try it yet, um, so I'm gonna get her to do that. Her lumbar has also been bothering her a lot, so obviously I am kind of concerned about that. Uh, her being a contortionist means that her back is pretty important to what we do. So um, she's been going to my chiropractor recently. I'm kind of hoping that that will start to work within the next couple of weeks. And then I've given her extra um, exercises to try and help strengthen the muscles around her lumbar to just give it a little bit of extra support while we're working. Um, but yeah, I, I've got to go. So let's go. Hello friends, it's Aaliyah. And I have been studying pretty much nonstop for the last three to four days. And my birds are suddenly screaming because I'm talking, which is pretty cool. But um, yeah, I have my final exam for anatomy and physiology. And I'm dying because there's so much to know and learn and ah. I'm taking notes on the reviews and I'm like, I keep pausing to take notes so it's taking me forever. I'm halfway to the end of the second review. Um, and after that, I think I'm going to take all of the PowerPoints from this part of the course and like make my mom learn them <laughs> and explain them. I should get a little pointer for that, but... Or I might go for a walk because I... my brain is done. My brain is dead. The exam is tomorrow, so wish me luck. I'll let you know how it goes. <laughs> the glass is so comically big. Maybe this should be big. Try drinking from the glass. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. <laughs> she looks like a toddler with a sippy cup. It's about the right size. <laughs> it's like half. It's literally like the size of your arm. It's yep. so big. My arms aren't tiny either. You're not much better. Toddlers don't go gray though. Or the plexi. Oh. <laughs> Nicely with the plexi, you don't get the personal. Oh, but that's half the fun. Do you remember that one time we were talking about shooting straws? Do you remember that one time that we, I think we were sitting here, if I'm not mistaken, and Brooklyn did, and she, there was an old guy sitting in the booth behind us, and she actually pegged him in the back of the head with a straw wrapper, and woke him up because he'd fallen asleep. Yeah, I remember that. <laughs> don't, look, don't look at me like that. Oh my God, it's like the same size as the glass. Excuse me, this is teaming up. I'm sitting on this bench alone. This isn't fair. You sat there. Okay. Oh, hey. <laughs> and I got it back too. <laughs> hey, hey, no, stop. Yes. Get away from me. I will duck under this table faster than you can say yamaha. One, two, three. <laughs> <laughs> hello, hello. I am on a walk because I needed a study break so badly. And it's so sunny and it's really, really hot. I think it's like 31 outside, but like, it's so hot. And um, I just need a study break because my brain was turning too mush. I mean, it's mush most of the time, but even mushier mush, which sucks. Um, it's like early evening right now and like at this point like I'll know the stuff I know and I won't know the stuff I don't know really um I'm not discouraged about it I'm actually like getting good marks on the practice quizzes and stuff it's just like a lot of content and you don't exactly know what will be on the exam there's specific things that we were told will be but there's so much the content that it's like 
okay, but there has to be more than that, right? And um, so I think that's what's making me second guess myself a little bit. Like even at this point, like I went through both of the whole course reviews and there can still be all of the questions about other concepts. Like there's just so much content, but maybe they'll make it a little bit easier. I don't know, we'll see. But yeah, I think I'll take it easy tonight, do some like passive studying, just looking over notes, stuff like that. Um, and we'll see how it goes tomorrow. These birds do just be walking. They're just crossing the street. Like, they're just crossing the street. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. I saw them walking and they're not even flying. I don't even know how they're walking. The ground's like burning hot, but like, you gonna fly my dudes? These little pigeon guys, oh. Just, they're just going for a stroll, you know? Going for a for a nice little stroll. <laughs> we don't even get pigeons down here, what the heck? Okay, hi. So, just got back from dinner with my mom and my sister. Um, I have two packages here. I don't know what they are, actually. I don't, I don't think either one of these are running medals. I mean, maybe this is, I don't know, it's pretty small. I don't know what this one is. This other one is big. Like, I am very confused about what this is. It's got my name and everything, but it's internationally tracked and signed. Um, it's come from Great Britain. I have no idea. So we're gonna open it and find out what it is. Okay, so this is a little one. I don't know what this one is. I was kind of hoping, I ordered two pride flags and I was kind of hoping they'd be coming in, but I don't think either of these are the pride flags I ordered, so. Mm. But we'll find out what this is. Because I don't think this is a running medal. It doesn't feel like a running medal. But maybe I'm wrong. Oh, Sesame. Well. Oh, are you kidding me? There's a wrap package in a wrap package? What is this nonsense? Okay, come on. Come on. What are you? What are you? Oh! These are my pride flags. Oh my gosh. This is so exciting. I didn't think these were the... Okay, well, color me surprised. These are my pride flags. What do you know? Okay, so I don't know which one is which. This is my ace flag, as you can tell. Very exciting. Ooh, look. I'm gonna wear it like a cape while I open the other one. And then this one, I'm wearing the end. Okay, okay, okay. I hope that looks savage. And then this one is my, maybe it goes this way, I don't know, my Demi flag. I don't know if you can tell, but this is my Demi flag. And then the one around my shoulders is my ace flag. I'm so excited. I'm so happy to have these. I'm definitely gonna have to try and find like a place to put them up. I don't know where I'm putting them yet, but I guess we'll find out. And then, wait, do you guys see how big this is? I'm not actually sure what this is supposed to be. Rock, open sesame. Oh, I'm making, okay, I'm gonna need scissors for this because I just punched myself in the boob. Hold on. Okay, so, this. Don't know what it is. Oh, maybe, oh, I think I might know what this, okay. You guys are gonna make fun of me for this, but just shush, okay? I'm kind of dorky. <laughs> I think this is, oh my God. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, it's sticky, uh. You guys. Okay, so don't make fun of me. <laughs> you 
Yo. Did I maybe buy one of those plots of land in Scotland? Yes, I did. Hello, my name is Lady Abigail. Nice to meet you. <laughs> I still can't believe I bought this thing. I, I bought one for my sister and shh, my mom. Shh, don't tell her. I'm giving it to her for her birthday. So, shh. but <laughs> I, I can't believe I actually bought it. But it is an official title, so I am officially Lady Abigail. And mom's gonna kill me when she sees this thing, but. Whatever, I don't know what I'm more excited about, this or my pride flag, maybe my pride flags actually. But at least we figured out what everything is. I also think I do have two medals that you guys haven't seen before, but obviously I'm not at home. So I'll have to show that to you in like the next couple of days or something. Oh, but while I'm here, I did sign up for a new race. I know, kill me. Um, I'm almost done my 500 kilometer race that I'm doing St. Francis Way. And I just signed up, um, the group that I run with uh, just released a new race. It's 806 kilometers. Yeah, okay. Um, my goal is to finish it before the cold weather kicks in because the gym at my apartment is still closed and everything. So I have one, two, three, three, maybe four months to complete 800 kilometers. So I'm gonna have to really push myself like 200 kilometers a month, which is gonna be a lot, mm. but we'll see. Um, I'm not gonna start that one until I finish the one that I'm currently doing, but at least I have some fun things to look at now. Yay! Hello, friends. Uh, little update, so after I came home from my walk, I was so like gross and stuff, and I just kind of wanted to take a break and relax. Um, and not study and just like kind of take my mind away from it for a while still. Um, so I cleaned my whole room, I, um, did both of the cages, did some vacuuming, put the laundry in, and had some dinner. Now I think I'm gonna probably look stuff over, but not study too hard, because, like, you know, if I cram, like, really hard, like, this night before, like, I, I'm, I'll be brain dead tomorrow morning, you know? Um, my exam's at 10 a.m., and I want to try to wake up at 8, so I have enough time to just, you know, get refreshed, feel okay, stuff like that. But yeah, fingers crossed, hope it goes well. So, it is right before my exam, I'm about 45 minutes away, eating a bagel, because <laughs> I need food before I do this. I woke up, like, 15 minutes ago, but, um... I'm kind of nervous. I'm so nervous. I keep reminding myself that the last one, like, I got an 80 on it, and I barely, barely-ish studied. I studied a lot more for this one, so I'm like, then it should be better, and, like, I'll end with enough time to look over the questions and stuff, but I still, like, I feel so nervous. Wish me luck. Ah! Okay, so y'all asked for kind of like a mini house tour. So, this is the deck area. We're just, like, moving a whole bunch of stuff out. So this is the general deck area. Pardon all the mess, we're cleaning things. Kitchen. That's Tracy, hi Tracy. Living room area. Front door. Kids room. Cute little bunk beds and stuff. A whole bunch of clothes. Bunk beds. Oh, hi again, Tracy. A uh, secondary guest room. Mm. All this nice stuff. Master bedroom. All the stuff in here. Tiny bathroom. And tiny little hallway table thing. This is the old stove. It is actually like a real fire. Stove goes all the way out to the top ah, and then back into the kitchen. It's really it's really not that big like as I said the kitchen's a bit of a mess because we're just taking everything out to the car. I think my favorite area is definitely de the deck though. It's so nice out here. This is where the girls and I spend most of our time when we're up here. I'm sure you can see why. Beautiful. <laughs> well oh my god my voice. <laughs> <coughs> 
it's over. Um, you know, it was okay. Just like, just like okay, because like most of the questions I got like right away. I finished like half an hour um, before like the time limit. But it's like multiple choice, so what are you gonna do if you don't know it? You don't know it, right? And um, but a lot of them I did know right away. There was some that I was kind of like scratching my head and I was thinking about, and I was like, huh. Um, there was one where I legitimately thought it was a typo. I don't know if that's concerning or just like a literal typo, but um, who knows. Um, but yeah, I feel okay about it. I think that's fine considering, you know the grades I have so far and stuff and now I'm gonna take like a seven year nap because I need it but I love you guys so much thank you for watching us and please check out our podcast all of our social media and I'll see you next week goodbye